Hello everyone. Uh, I'm again here with the explanation of the 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 following activities. In this case, I would like to talk to the feedback activity forum glossary hot potatoes lesson mind map. If possible, um, if possible, also I would like to talk about the uh, mind map mind map sorry okay let's start uh, feedback is like can go this uh, with this tool you can or, the, or, or with this activity you, you can make small tools um, asking your students some questions regarding to the course or other kind of questions a small pools as I say small <coughs> questionnaires and in this uh, in the, in this case, I, what I I done is to ask them about the, some aspects of the course. If they are difficult or contents, or grammatical or lexical or other terms or other items, they they don't they, they, they weren't able to grasp or to understand. Uh, you can set uh, here the, this question like uh, anonymous, okay? Or we know with display the number of the uh, the name of the student mm -hmm. even though allow multiple submissions or not or just one or notifications uh, and the number of the questions here the number of the auto number of the questions um, for each questions okay this thing is not interesting and um, let's let's see the result I can save and display we see here Okay, there's like information about this kind of uh, this this pool in in this case. Um, we can answer the questions here. Okay, in which part of this unit you have uh, been struggling with? Okay, the verbs, uh, the listening, the reading. Okay, and the taking one of these boxes. or oh, okay, they can give some some feedback. But here I once and again I try and this limited this box for one, two, three, four, five characters. Just five characters. I don't know what if I'm doing something wrong with the settings or I mean it does the limitation with this 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 part. I'm not sure about that. Okay, let's move on to the next activity. In this kind in this case it's the forum, like one of the base tools in in, in model no? in, uh, for all uh, for all for, for all, uh, in general for all subjects but for uh, for uh, foreign languages for teaching of foreign languages I think it's an amazing tool here let's see inside uh, let's see the settings and this tool okay it's question and forum um, this kind of question there are different kind of uh, different kind of uh, forums as you see here a single simple discussion each person post one discussion question and forum is what I, I chose a standard and a standard forum for general user uh, use sorry well vale, the maximum uh, I put a limit the maximum attachment size is uh, 10 megabytes uh, limited to okay let's put it uh, to the files I didn't put like a display word count a limited um, oh, that's, I think it may be interesting let's put it there let's set it this way the grade you can grade them ratings average no ratings kind of ratings minimum maximum okay let's put the average one maximum points even though restrict the access and, and the days when they, they had to interact in, in this in this in this forum and the activity completion here okay and they they are required to do uh, this kind of things okay receive a grade and complete this activity at least they had to reply one time um, to pause one entrance okay the result and the final result it will be like this okay I ask them to talk some of this uh, to choose uh, among one of these uh, topics 
okay and another their their own opinion or their own work and you see i i done in advance one entrance and in putting me myself in a in a student's uh, point of view okay my i want to talk about my family we are four and so on so on. okay uh, this is the forum part as i say is one of the, my favorite two activities and this one the next one um, is the glossary another cool activity for a uh, for teaching foreign languages uh, they can create students uh, you can i mean the teacher or the manager or the person in charge they can create their own uh, the class vocabulary you know to personalize what kind of the uh, lexical items they want to use there and in this case okay let's talk about the house uh, i put a blob a uh, pic a picture and i put on a fresh uh, example no to contextualize the the use of this word mm -hmm. and for now the students okay they can mm -hmm. i said before they can make some comments okay about this this job or to add in another uh, entrance okay the another word mm -hmm. even though they, you can write you can write uh, no ratings and there are some metrics the teacher can write a uh, great uh, uh, students uh, the students entrance or their job mm. well the forum glossary hot potatoes this is the external external authoring tool and um, i done one activity let's see it here mm -hmm. okay um i was playing around before okay let's delete delete the previous attempts okay and um, let's see the quiz i have done with hot potatoes is uh, kind of mess as i was as i say i was playing around it's nothing serious it's like a kind of cross a uh, cross word and here we are color de la leche what kind of color is the milk uh, let's put it blanco i thought not to be wrong okay i get it check it out okay 60 percent is right mm -hmm. this uh, hot potatoes uh, offers you a different kind of activities it's, it's free you can down, uh, download to to your desktop or computer and to compare uh, to make a scrum a scrum files to 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 add in the platforms like Moodle. Um, I think I jump external tool. Okay, glossary hot potatoes lesson. I think let, let's see this uh, this activity. Mm -hmm. But I jump here is talking about uh, one of the grammatical points the adjective when some explanation in japanese are you serious and there are a lot of kanjis my students are japanese and i hope this thing it will really help them we can pass to the next one okay as a manager i can see my like a progress bar here mm -hmm. Okay, and let's here. Even though uh, we did, let's go back here and let's let's change, switch my role to the to the students' point of view. Let's see from another per perspective. A student, like a student, and you see, let's go to the manager practice area and let's get in in the lesson the student will see this part can you see okay 60 percent they have same and move on mm -hmm. 
um, here is what I, what I finish I'm sorry I, even though they, you can add some activities and questions and quiz here I think I've done before but I don't know what is happening now I can find this part maybe I'm wrong and I, I did it in, in another part because uh, I've been playing once and again with a lot of activities and resources um, I return to my normal role and this one is gonna be my um, the last activity I'm gonna explain in this video because it's, the length is, is being too much uh, my map okay this activity it took me a while to get used to to get used to that I think it's as simple they are more like a more like a, a mental maps a, these kind of tools they are the kind of reach with a multimedia pictures even though even though videos they can embed in the in these kind of things here is like a simple just yes, you can add test for instance my family abuelos padres mm -hmm. a layout okay uh, layout, let's move it here here and let's add another one mm -hmm. padre abuelo here we go you can amplify move around mm -hmm. imprimir layout even though to change the color it's a, it's a mental map I think it's too much simple and a little bit complicated. In, in my case, I, I would like to have like some visual, visual hints to enrich the content you are, you are giving or to your students. But it's anyway, it's a, it's a, I think it's a good tool. Well, with this part, I think I'm done because I am reaching the limit of, or uh, uh, allowed in uh, a screen. Uh, screen a uh, screen customatic sorry okay bye bye see you later